Welcome to Train Sim World 2, an immersive and highly detailed rail simulation featuring authentic routes and trains from around the world. You've just been awarded some action points. These are displayed in the top right corner of the screen and count towards your overall experience. It is necessary to be fully observant of the surrounding world. Practice by looking up, down, left and right. Besides operating trains, there are lots of requirements to navigate on foot. Try moving around now. This is one of many interactives to be discovered, but not all of them will be as easy to find as this one. You can pause the experience at any point and review previous and current objectives. Check it out now, then return to the game when ready. A heads up display has appeared on the right side of the screen. This is a guide to what the train is doing. This is the speed display. The white needle shows current speed. The red marker indicates the maximum permitted speed. This is the direction display. An arrow will indicate forward, reverse and neutral directions. This is the power display. A number will indicate what position the power control is in. These are brake indicators. They show the state of the various brake systems, allowing independent management of them. In the top right are the signal and speed limit displays. These feature an indication of what is approaching and a countdown distance to when they will come into effect. Some of these displays can be hidden via the settings menu for a more challenging experience. Brighton Main Line runs for roughly 55 miles and runs express services to Gatwick Airport as well as commuter services between Brighton and London Victoria. This particular train is a Gatwick Express Class 387 electric multiple unit and consists of 8 cars. Train Sim World 2 allows you to ride and drive from a selection of camera views. Let's take a look now while exploring this train.
You've only explored a small area here, so let's take a look at what else there is to enjoy. Welcome to Brighton Mainline, located in the southeast of England. Here you can experience one of Britain's busiest main lines linking the capital to the seaside resort of Brighton via the international hub of Gatwick Airport. Along the way, be sure to place route maps, put up tourist posters, refill newspaper stands and put up seagull signs. Choose express services to Gatwick or packed commuter services through the British countryside. Welcome to Brighton Mainline, London, Victoria to Brighton. Welcome to driver training. Today you will be taken through the operation of a class 3774 electric multiple unit in Southern Livery. During this brief introduction, we will go through the critical driver controls and passenger operations. When you are ready, climb aboard to get started. Take a seat in the driver's seat. This is where you'll be spending most of your time. Set the master key to on to begin the startup procedure. Take a quick glance at the platform to ensure it is safe before unlocking the doors. The reverser determines the direction of travel. Coasting is a method used to efficiently maintain speed and reduce motor stress and maintenance requirements. Keeping to speed limits is important. If you begin over speeding, apply a small amount of brake by moving the combined power handle into the braking range.
You are now approaching the first stop. Use the combined power handle to apply a small amount of brake force to achieve a comfortable and safe stop. Proceed to the next stop unguided this time and see how you get on.
Good work! That concludes all of the basics of operating this train. Welcome to driver training. Today you will be taken through the operation of a class 387 electric multiple unit in Gatwick Express livery. During this brief introduction we will go through the critical driver controls and passenger operations. When you are ready, climb aboard to get started. Take a seat in the driver's seat. This is where you'll be spending most of your time. Set the master key to on to begin the startup procedure. Now we'll need to power the train. This train supports both overhead and third rail power. Although on this route, we will need to use the third rail. The reverser determines the direction of travel.
Coasting is a method used to efficiently maintain speed and reduce motor stress and maintenance requirements. Keeping to speed limits is important. If you begin over speeding, apply a small amount of brake by moving the combined power handle into the braking range. You are now approaching the first stop. Use the combined power handle to apply a small amount of brake force to achieve a comfortable and safe stop. Take a quick glance at the platform to ensure it is safe before unlocking the doors. Proceed to the next stop unguided this time and see how you get on. Yes. 
We will now perform an emergency brake test. Great work, we can now continue our journey. Good work! That concludes all of the basics of operating this train.